Hello, my name is Steve Lang. I'm a developer technology specialist at Microsoft based in Colorado, USA. Today, I'm going to give you a quick overview of Azure benefits for MSDN subscribers, what that means, and how easy it is to sign up for those benefits. First, did you know that as an MSDN subscriber, you are entitled to free credits each month to use on the Microsoft Azure platform? Depending on your level, you either have access to $50, $100, or even $150 per month. Over the course of a year, that can add up to $1,800 of free cloud credit. So how can you spend all this free money? Well, virtually any service offered by Microsoft Azure is available to you. This includes virtual machines or web apps, which are both great for dev test scenarios, databases, or other services such as automation, biz talk, service bus, etc. Now, keep in mind that these benefits are not enabled by default, but activating them for your MSDN subscription is super easy. I'll show you. First, go to the MSDN subscription site and sign in. On the right, under Quick Links, <clears throat> excuse me, you'll see access to your benefits. On the benefits page, in the Microsoft section, click Activate Microsoft Azure. That will take you to the sign up page. Simply fill out the form, much of which may already be completed for you, and in the mobile verification section, Enter your mobile phone number. Click Send Text Message, and Microsoft will send you a text containing a verification code. Once you receive that code, enter it and click Verify Code. Once that's complete, simply check the first box to accept your Azure agreement, and then click the Sign Up button. Let the magic work. Let the magic work on the site, and then you'll be set up in just a quick second. And that's it. Welcome to Microsoft Azure, where you are now using your newly activated MSDN benefits so you can play in the cloud for free. And do you notice that you were not asked for any type of credit card or other payment information? Azure knows you're using your MSDN benefits, so it simply debits your consumption from whatever limit you get each month, again, based on your Visual Studio product level. If you use up all of your benefits for a given month, it simply turns off your services until the next billing cycle. Pretty simple. So to wrap up, as an MSDN subscriber, you have access up to $150 each month to use for virtually any Azure service offering. Activating your benefits is quick and easy and doesn't require a credit card. So that's it. Thanks for watching and enjoy your Microsoft Azure benefits from MSDN.